My name is Dr Claire Lippitz. I'm a forensic medical examiner known as an FME. So a forensic examination is offered to people who've been sexually assaulted in order to collect forensic evidence. So there's a forensic medical doctor like myself who will do the examination and they will be assisted uh, by a crisis worker. In some cases um, we have uh, a presence of a nurse and sometimes we have a second doctor also present. There's always someone to really take care of the person being examined which really helps because if someone decides actually that's enough then we're listening to them so we will only do what the person wants us to do in terms of evidence collection. So one of the really important principles of forensic examination and indeed any examination uh, with a nurse or a doctor is that it's done with consent. So somebody has to say it's okay for us to do the examination. And even if at the beginning they think everything's fine, if there's a moment when they want to stop, that's also absolutely fine. So they can withdraw their consent at any point in the examination. The important thing is that we're listening to them and meeting their needs. So most people come and see us because they've made uh, a report to the police but that doesn't have to be in that order. So people can contact the Sexual Assault Referral Centre and they can have what's called a self-referral so that they can be examined by a forensic medical examiner. Now that's quite important because they may not know what they want to do. But if they have a forensic medical examination, then we can collect evidence and then we can offer them medical care and they can decide at a later date whether or not they want to report it to the police. But the main thing I would say to people who are thinking about having a forensic examination is do come and see us and do trust us to look after you. We can offer the best care for you, have evidence collection, give you the medical care that you need and you can withdraw at any time you want. But please make contact with us. Don't be afraid, we're not here to hurt you, we're here to help you.